Tonight we have breaking news and one of the worst tragedies Austin has seen in nearly 30 years. Last year's huge South by Southwest Music Festival was overshadowed by an accused drunk driver plowing his car into a crowd of fans. The aftermath has been devastating for the victims and their families. And now we have learned several of them have filed lawsuits against the festival organizers. You'll remember last March, this man, Rashad Owens, was charged with capital murder for his role in the crash that killed 18-year-old DeAndre Tatum, 26-year-old Sandy Lee, 27-year-old Jamie West, and 35-year-old Stephen Cranmere. The lawsuits named the two private companies that own the festival, South by Southwest Holdings Incorporated and South by Southwest LLC. The traffic design consultant South by Southwest hired to oversee the road closures as well as the driver Rashad Owens. The victims are seeking unspecified monetary damages and changes to the way South by Southwest controls street closures. They claim South by organizers did not do enough to keep people safe. I sat down with Jamie West's husband, Evan, who was also seriously hurt in the crash and spent four months in the hospital. What do you hope to accomplish? Um, I mean, for it to... <laughs> I mean, I'm doing this because the goal is for it to... <laughs> doing it because the goal is for it to not happen again. It's... That's the biggest thing, is that people should... People shouldn't go through this. She and I are... We tried to live a life and be good people. And it's big to talk about the world, but you know, you need those things. You need people just trying to be good, do good. And it can be in the smallest ways. Jamie threw like little arts and trinkets and just, you know, being friendly and kind. But that's a, a huge loss because there's not enough of it.